मेरे चैनल को सब्सक्राइब करें और बेल आइकन को ऑल पे सेट करें हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू साउथ टेक्सटाइल अकेडमी टुडे वी आर विद अ वेरी स्पेशल गेस्ट श्री वलसलन सर हु इज द रिटायर्ड प्रेसिडेंट ऑफ दामोदर इंडस्ट्री ग्रुप प्रेसिडेंट सो सर फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वेलकम टू आवर चैनल या थैंक यू Uh, sir i would like to ask you how was the overall experience uh, working in damodar group it was really nice to work with the damodar group i was worked there for uh, 14 years started my career there as a gm then uh, elevated to vice vp then later on became the group president okay sir Sir, Damodar Threads was uh, known for producing uh, top quality of uh, slab and fl- fancy yarn during your period of uh, service. Yeah. So, what, what was the was... what was the secret behind it? There is no secret. For Damodar, it is a normal yarn. We used to produce a lot of fancy yarn. One of it is slab yarn. We start with the mechanical slab units. Later, later on, we start uh, kaipo, pinder, and uh, scat, etc. So we have more than thirty, thirty-six units in a single unit, and it was further increased to around forty-eight units. So slab is almost a major part of our production. We produce from six counts to up to forties regularly. Sometimes it may go up to fifties count. Sir, you use the same kind of blending ratio for six any, nine any, and up to forty any yarn. So, yeah. was it a profitable approach? Of course, why not? You are getting better price, and you are getting more productivity. then the mission downtown time is very less you are getting 97% utilization in a blue room and around 95% in 94 to 95% in ring frame so that itself give you reward when you are considering the price of fiber and yarn Our profit was much better in our products. Sir, my next question is how to prevent the loss of uh, slab perimeters uh, during a uh, production stage. You see, when we are producing slab yarn, we start from mechanical slab units to the most. advanced slab attachments so in these days the failure rate is much much less but of course you have to take precautions to avoid any mistakes or any non conformity in quality for that you have to take precautions right from your programming to the end product we first produce the program then it will feed to a particular machine then make a sample and let it confirm for the parameters then only we start production we have more than 100 150 varieties of slab yarn yarns and variety of slab yarn it is not a simple slab yarn multi slab multi length slab multi thickness multi thickness length and uh, even uh, you can say multi fiber injections everything okay so sir uh, there is a specialized software uh, installed uh, we use install in ut5 for checking slab parameters so can you tell us yes. something about that Yes, this is uh, this was uh, around uh, 
2012 it was started so we are the one in india first got this unit and it was working very nicely there is no problem when, whenever you start a mixing new quality you feed the program in the machine and take the first 10 bobbins sample bobbin you check it in the machine you will you can assess the quality of the yarn as well as the what program we have made whether it is correct or not we can uh, confirm that from this resource earlier we used to check manually number of slabs thickness of visual and all those things and slope to slope distance everything but here you will get everything in a printout so it is very easy for that and also we used to check the boards at least every machine we will start producing around 10 boards per machine so that you can assess whether there is any variation in these boards and how far it is affecting and the other thing final stage we used to make a fabric sample from a particular quality that will be assessed against the what the result we are getting in ut5 so that will confirm and we start producing only after that in the machine and in bulk production someday it may work in a 10 machines someday it may work for one or two machines sir what is the maximum possible finer count you can use for uh, the production of slab yarn without any problem you can work up to 60s if you want you can work 100 also because the final or the fiber micron air value you can get the number of fiber in the cross sections so you can go for 100 also okay so sir what is the difference between mechanical slab attachment and electronical slab attachment the vast difference because in mechanical everything is depends upon the clutch and functioning of that clutch and if any failure in a clutch or any jam any looseness everything there are springs and all those things it is a magnetic effect that create a magnetic effect and that will uh, activate accordingly the failure rate is much higher even if you maintain very well mechanically and electrically we can observe that there will be a lot of problem but in, in these days there are more precious slab attachments are the like uh, amsler tinder kaipo kaipo is not there now now only tinder is there then in india uh, the best slab manufacturers are scat I have gone through that their results and uh, Amsler as well as this thing, all are matching very well. Okay. Sir, uh, can you uh, tell us what is the process of uh, manufacturing ejected slab yarn? It is injection slab. You can say injection. Uh, giving okay. injection something else. That is the thing. Here, if this injection is mostly doing with the double yarn and the fancy yarn and all this. Also, you can use in a cotton with the polyester, linen, viscose, polynose, anything. Or you can even use a colored material to a gray one. So, for that, two types you can use. Either you can provide a fourth roller in the ring frame, or you can feed the main yarn from the second roll and the injection from the third roll. So you can produce injection slab. As per your desired design, as well as the number of slabs, thickness, everything. This mostly using in double yarn, double or triple yarn in for uh, upholstery, or uh, curtains, fabrics, and all those things. 
sir uh, how many slub program can be saved in one ring frame it is up to the capacity of the equipment we can store more than 100 program in a particular machine and uh, you can use it as as and when you wanted to use that slub program you only put the number you will get or the name damodar we used to give numbers uh, not numbers names for every slab we give a number a name maxi slab like that so many names so this name is the so you can just record record that program and start that program that is enough you will take hardly 30 seconds sir apart from cotton and polyester which fiber do you use for uh, making slab yarn you can go for viscose polynosy even uh, linen in the other we use to process all these fiber linen viscose polynosy then uh, cotton sir my next question is uh, sir how to prevent side cut problems in ring frame that is not for uh, normal isn't it for slab yarn you see earlier there is a problem whenever there is a power fluctuation what happen this entire machine sides will at end all ends are get down and you have to restart the machine but in our days what is a people use a ups so that will take care of the power solution for 30 up to 30 minutes so there is no immediate stoppage of machine it slowly it will stop so there is no side cut ah of course if you are stopping this machine for a long period then you have to release the pressure top and pressure if it is pneumatic it is easy to switch off that air supply if it is mechanical you have to raise the top arm and release the pressure so that you can uh, reduce the ends down but for a uh, for a fraction of 10 15 30, 20 minutes nothing will happen because this ups will take care of the power needs of the slab unit sir what type of quality issues you have observed during your career you see quality problems naturally it can happen some day there may be a slab missing sometimes it may be a big yarn or such type of things will come but uh, these are all during the starting of the slab yarn production then later on our yarn were sold at, as a cot cake cot cake there was we never faced any problem in slab yarn main problems mainly occur is slab missing slab to slab length variation number of slab per unit length this can vary if uh, any machine slab unit is malfunctioning so you have to take care of maintenance of the slab units take care of the uh, motors and all those things you have to periodically check and verify that it is functioning properly sir according to your opinion should a graduate start his career in sqc maintenance or production department uh, to become a successful technician you see these are all uh, the part of a textile unit the basic thing you can understand from the qa what is fiber what is yarn what is the quality parameters all these thing you are understanding from qa department when you come to the production department or maintenance department, you are learning the machine machine parts and function and all those things when you come to the production you are really come to a challenge to manage the workforce to manage the machines achieve the targets and maintaining the quality consistently 
सर व्हाट वाज द इफेक्ट ऑफ रिसेशन इन स्लब यान मार्केट नेचुरली देयर विल बी अ लॉट ऑफ रिसेशन इन दिस यान बिकॉज़ दिस यान इज मोस्टली कॉस्टलीयर देन नॉर्मल यान दिस 30 टू 40 परसेंट कॉस्टलीयर देन द नॉर्मल यान so people in this time you see when uh, corona virus start affecting the whole world first people used to reduce the purchase of fabrics that is the only thing we can extend the life so people used to the purchase of clothing reduce considerably that affect the whole textile industry so that is the effect In that time naturally people will not go for a high value fabric people go for a simple and uh, affordable fabric clothing as well as their uh, curtains sheets and everything that is why now polyester is mostly people are using you cannot see 100% cotton nowadays you can see mostly polyester rich blend fabric okay sir. that is change now so this was it for today's video thank you sir for providing your time to us and uh, to all our viewers uh, it's our request if you like the video please uh, share it with your colleagues and friends so that uh, our video could uh, reach a uh, higher number of audience so thank you so much sir thank you thank you very much i would like to congratulate you people to collect the information from experts and that is circulating with the needies thank for this service okay okay sir thank you sir okay.